Hey guys, um, welcome back, and I hope that you guys like the video that I will be posting for my first video for this evening, um, or whatever. Um, I have three more boxes and a bunch more stuff <clears throat> um, to show you guys, because, I mean, I, I'm kind of a fanatic, I mean, there's some stuff... I, I just, I feel like I always have to have it. So I was like, okay, well, I get to show you guys. It's okay. You guys can see me spend my money. Um, but yeah, um, I hope you guys like this video. Make sure you give me that like button and also that subscribe. I'm doing a 50 uh, subscriber giveaway. So if anyone is interested make sure that you hit that like button that subscribe and also that comment that I need so and also for you guys to enjoy the stuff that I want to give you all right let's go ahead and start my way in um, my next box is actually a Morphe box now I've already gotten one of um, this is my second um, I'm sorry, you guys. My second mystery box from Morphe because I like Morphe. It's really nice. So this is the surprise box, the nice nine-piece face and eye collection. So let's see if I got the same items as I got before. I don't know. Because I'm just opening it up just now. I was actually really excited to get home today. One, because of this. And two, because literally I've been at work since Wednesday and I just really wanted to, oops, I'm sorry, really wanted to just get home. Um, I work with teenagers and I'm like, man, I'm, I'm done. I really just want to, you know, <laughs> be done with, with work. All right, so the first thing that I see right now are some brushes. I'm really excited. I love brushes in any of my boxes. So, of course, I got this brush, which is the Morphe R14. It's like a face brush. It's a contour brush. So that's nice. I love contouring. Or I love trying to contour. <laughs> I don't do it very well. But I definitely try. Alright. So this is the R39 Tapered Blender Brush. I think I have a couple of these already. But you know what? I can always do for some more. So it's it has like gold. The gold thing right here. And it's nice and soft. I love it. I definitely think I have another one of these, but I don't really care. So this is the R34 Deluxe Blender Brush. I think I might have one. I don't really care. I can always do for some brushes, but this is what it looks like. So it's nice. I like that. All right. <clears throat> this is the Blushing Babes Pop of Pink. Um, this is the blush trio. I'm sorry, you guys. I'm still trying to get over my cold, and it's just not working out. I just need to stop talking, but I, I can't do it. I, I love to talk. Ooh, so this is, I did not get this shade. I'm really excited about it. So this is the lighter one. So that's really nice. Rule breaker, free, and sp spirit. I'm really excited about that. <coughs> Alright, my next one is a lip gloss. Frosty. I think I got this one. I'm pretty sure I do. It's like, it smells like plastic. But I, I'm pretty sure I got this one. I don't really remember. But here is the outer layer. Super pretty. And this is what the like the little applicator looks like. I'm not gonna swatch it because I'm pretty sure I have one. Um, if not, then oh well. 
I do like a lot of lip glosses. All right, so here's another one, a lip crayon. It's called L-Y-L-A-S. I don't think I have this one. I know that I don't have this one. But these are actually super nice. They come on like really nice and creamy. I like that. I really like the rosy nudes too. <clears throat> super pretty. All right, let's see. Oh, Morphe. So this is one of their la matte lipsticks. I actually got this color in my um, Ipsy bag from last month. So, I mean, I really like the red, so I'm going to definitely keep it. But here is a swatch. It comes on matte. It's a really super pretty red. I like it. It's really nice. All right. So, ooh, this one's ripped, kind of. This is... Um, they're Morphe lashes, and I'm learning how to do them. I'm like a terrible person. I'm, I'm terrible at doing them, but I'm definitely going to try. This is called Posh. So those are really pretty. I'm going to definitely try to work on those. But yeah, it's, it's a really nice lash. <coughs> All right. <coughs> so the last thing is their palette that I just got. Um, the R35 Ready, Set, Gold. Let's see if I have this one. I have a feeling that I do. Ooh, I don't. I've seen a lot of people get this palette and I was like, oh man, I really want this one. So it's really pretty. I like, I like all the... Like, on this side right here is all shimmers, and then all here is, like, all the mattes. Oh, I'm so excited. I love it. Look how pretty that is. That's so pretty. I love that. I love that. Oh, man. Let's get... And they're so nice and creamy. Here's a gold. Ooh. Ooh, wow. <laughs> Whoa, it really like it can spread. Let's try a mat. Even the mats are so creamy. I love it. So pretty. Cannot wait to play with this too. No, wait. I do like Morphe a lot, so I'm really excited about it. All right. My next box. This is some more Morphe stuff. Let's see. Here's my. So I got the Best Sweat Secrets. It's a 20-piece face and eye brush collection. Um, when I saw this, I was like, oh my gosh, gotta have it. <clears throat> Look at all these brushes. Oh. I am like literally like my brushes are my brush collection now is seriously like growing. It's insane. So I'm I'm just I'm I've never felt so excited right now. Because now I have that subscription, um, the Morphe Morphe Me. <clears throat> so yeah. This is such a cool I like these. Oh man, this is called Morphe 4495. That's so cool. I, I, I'm so excited. 
Oh man, did I get a kabuki brush? I did. Ooh, oh, that's so nice and soft. Look at this. So, um, this is the Y6. It's like a kabuki brush. I like this. I love kabuki brushes. And it's nice and gold and hard and nice. <clears throat> this is the M518 Crease Fluff Brush. So nice. I love brushes. I, f I feel like I don't have enough. So I'm, I'm really excited. This is a really nice soft brush. This is the M518. Here's another gold one. I love brushes. I'm so excited. This is the Y11. I'm assuming this is like that kind of brush. The M461 uh, Duo Jumbo Crease Brush. So it's, it, it looks really nice. So it's like, it's nice and soft. I like it. Oh my gosh, there's so many brushes, it's crazy. I'm just, I'm just excited to be home. Literally, okay, so this is the R36 Pointed Highlight Brush. It's nice and soft, I like that too. <clears throat> hey bud my dog alright so this is the M178 dash or 170 dash 8 it's the oval lip brush I don't deal with a lot of brushes with the lips but maybe, I mean, I mean, I might be able to use it somehow. I mean, who doesn't? Um, this is the M530 Contour Blender Brush. I love brushes. It's so nice and soft. I love brushes. Um, this is the M507 Pointed Mini Blender Brush. I love blender brushes. So you can easily be able to like pack it in on this outer corner right there. Um, this is the M707 3-4th Oval Foundation Brush. I doubt that I'm going to use this for my foundation, but maybe I'll use it for something. Maybe. For something else, I mean. Um, Morphe E53. It's a nice... It's really fluffy. I like that. Maybe a blush. Who knows? Um, M422, the Crescent Shadow Brush. Ooh, I need a lot of these, I feel like. I don't even know. Even, like, blending brushes, too. Ooh, this is, like, a nice thick handle. I like that. I'm so excited for these. Hey, buddy. Um, this one is the M503 Pro Firming Blending Fluff Brush. Do you want me to move that button? <laughs> Go ahead and lay down. <clears throat> the Pro Firming Blending Fluff Brush. I'm so excited for brushes. 
I'm, I'm, I am running out of room, but I'm definitely going to try. This is the M562 Tiny Crease Blender Brush. I like that. That's really nice. The Morphe Y5. I feel like a lot of these brushes they're just trying to get rid of because they, <laughs> they, I mean, they can't get rid of these. So, I mean, it feels, they, they're nice, but they're just, they just feel really cheap. More brushes. What the heck is this one? This is the M705 Morphe brush. I have no idea what this is. Like, look at that. Who, who, maybe this is for a concealer? I have no idea. Anyone in the comments, if you know what this brush is, please tell me. It's the M705. <laughs> Comments are definitely welcomed in this in this joint. Oh, um, this is the fi M five thirteen round blender brush. I, mean, I I'm getting a lot of blender brushes, which is I'm totally fine with. I like blender brushes. Um, here is a M four zero eight chisel shader brush. I'm not, I'm still like learning on how to do the shading part, but this is what it looks like. It's like the nice handles. This is the R39 tapered blender brush. Didn't I just say R39? Mm, I have no idea. But of course, nice and soft and white. And then this is the Pro Firm Blending Fluff Brush 433. I feel like I have that one. Just got that one too. I have no idea. But of course, nice. Another nice brush. Let's put these brushes back in here. Let's put some of this stuff back in here. Or er, put it in here. I'm kind of running out of them. All right, let's go through here again because I got I got some more stuff, y'all. All right, so this is the 18B Make and Bank Artistry Palette. Oh, I forgot that I got this actually. It's actually really super pretty. So of course here are the all the shades. You can see my mess in here. So here it is. Super pretty. Here's some like neutrals and like some greens and some blues. I really like that. Uh, this is like one of the reasons why I got this this color right here. Okay, let's try this schnit out. Oh, look at that ice blue. I love that. That's so pretty. Oh. So pretty. I'm going to try this green because I just have to, you know? Look at that. Look at that. That's super pretty. Super excited. So excited. Oh, I'm going to definitely, uh, like tomorrow's going to be like one heck of a day. I swear. All there will be is, <coughs> will be try-ons. Just saying. Okay, so here's another one, 18F, uh, Talk and Flirty. Now, um, these smaller pa palettes are actually $18. And my dog just farted. And then here are the shades. 
this is like the like pretty um, dates palette pretty much oh, this wine color one seems a little dry Super pretty colors. I love this. So nice. I'm like the next like I don't even know how many days. The next so many days, all there will be is like try-ons. Try-ons, try-ons, try-ons. Alright, my next palette is the Jaslyn Hill palette. Um, a lot of people have this palette, which I was actually very intrigued on being able to try it out because I was like, I really like the colors and I was like, oh man, I, I just really want to try it because they're super pretty. They have like a lot of colors that I would definitely use. Oh, I really like this blue. I'm really, I, I'm really liking this blue. Oh, so pretty. I love it. I'm gonna try this pink right here. You can barely tell. Let's try this. This is a dark green. Super pretty. I love this. Ooh, that's so pretty. I'm so excited. But yeah, I've seen a lot of people. Um get this palette and it's it's so pretty i was like i really want to try this i'm i'm turning colors because of the eyeshadows you know like <laughs> okay all right so this is the 39l hit the lights palette it's super big i don't even remember getting this box or getting this palette Oh, this is a new palette. I remember. Oh, okay. Ooh, wait, what is this? Oh, okay, okay. So, like, it tells me where it was created by. Um, like, created by Bianca Loves Makeup 91. Created by XT heel uh created by oh wait no it, it, oh wow this is really cool so like it tells me like who was created by i'm not gonna keep it but yeah so this is the 39l palette super nice super big i love it really nice um let's see okay so there's this i'm gonna try this <coughs> oops <coughs> um i'm gonna go for this one. Oh wow i'm gonna go for this and go for this okay look at you barely see like the pinky color, but it's like a really shimmery color. And that red freaking stands out, man. I'm excited to try this one too. All right, so I will be doing a lot of try-ons, a lot of like, um, a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff is going on this week. I'm super excited. So, here is my last box. This is nothing with makeup. It's actually Stitch Fix. I've had this for a while. Um, the, uh, styling fee is $20. And then you guys can pick any of the items that you may like to have um I kind of have an idea on what I got because I did look on the app today on what I was going to be getting so I'm really excited uh to check this out 
I don't know what I'm going to keep or not. Here is my bag of um, my returns. So whenever I return, whatever I return will go in here. I haven't decided on what I'm going to get. All right, so here is my little envelope. And here is my receipt. If I were to get all of this. <coughs> um, yeah. So I'm going to keep that. And then here is like my little cards that I got. Uh, that will like. That goes with the items that my stylist had picked. So. Um. My stylist actually sent me a message. It says, hello again, uh, Patricia. I hope this finds you well. Did you have a great holiday and new year? I searched for black leggings, but wasn't able to find a good fit. They, uh, because I've been asking for some black leggings um, for a while, and they just haven't been able to find any. Um, they are on top of my list for next fix. Um, what do you think of the Cosmic Blue Love Distressed Blue Jeans? So, I got a pair of blue jeans. Let me grab those. So, here are some blue jeans that I just got. So, I thought these were capris for a second. They look kind of small, so I'm going to have to try these on, definitely. Which, tomorrow, I will be trying these on. So, they are really cute. I like these blue jeans. Uh, the blue jeans are actually $88. It's a size... Actually, I wear a size 12, so it's a size 12. mine okay sorry I got a message um so these blue jeans are $88 super cute I like it yeah. all right um they have a lighter wash that you were hoping for and the distressing adds to an edgier fill <clears throat> Add a long sleeve t-shirt or tee and layer with the coffee shop vest with cargo style and complete the look with the splendid footwear ballot flats. Another top that I thought would be a fun piece that crosses your athletic style and prefer preference for edgy. The threads for thought pullover, the back detail is so fun it would pair well with any of your favorite bottoms. The tart blazer was a close piece to match your white cardigan request. Uh, the collar cut adds a sassy finish. XO Amanda J. Thank you, Amanda. Okay, so let's go ahead and start. So this is the cardigan that she... Ooh, I, I might actually really keep this. So it's like, it's really nice. It's like a maroon color and it's a folly color kind of I guess or winter color look at that that's so cute I like that I like that a lot this is a really good um th uh, I don't know what it's called <laughs> all right so here is the blazer it's like a camel I don't know if I want this. I have to try it on. But on the on the phone, it just did not look. So this is um, <coughs> olive camo, the, the vest. Um, the coffee shop Mia printed cargo vest. So it, it is really cute. Um, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, the, oh, I'm sorry, the Threads for Thought, um, the Racerback Burgundy Color shirt 
is $64. The cargo vest is $78. Here is the blazer, and it is really cute and soft. Oops. And to be honest, I think this is a little ridiculous. It's an off-white, of course. Um, it's $98. I don't know if I would want this. It is really cute, though. I like it. Um, let me, ooh, okay, so, I mean, it's comfortable. Are these actually, oh, yeah, they are actual pockets. I mean, it's nice, it's comfortable. So I'll have to look at that. And my last item are the Splendid Footwear Axle Printed Canvas. So these are actually camo flats. And they're $69. I think I might just say mix my shoes request because I feel like the shoe request thing is always like so wrong. Like they they send me some really cute stuff, but it's not my style of shoe. And I try to give her my my thing, my like my my request. And I'm like, what is this? What are these shoes? Why? So who knows? All right. So I hope you guys liked all of my unboxings, my hauls, everything, all the things that I got in the mail. Um, I'll be back with you guys tomorrow. Make sure you guys hit that like button and also that subscribe button. I do have my giveaway going on and, um, it, and it'll help me get through the, um, through this journey that I am trying to progress in. Um, and I hope you guys have a good night. I know it's past midnight. I have no idea what time it is. Um, I think it's, what time is it? It is 2 a.m. in the morning. Oh boy. So, hit that like, hit that subscribe, comment if you like this as well. Um, if there's something that you guys would like to see, uh, let me know as well and I will definitely help you out. Um, I hope you guys have a good day, and I'll see you guys later on. Bye!